Hey, how's it going, everybody? So, originally, I wasn't going to make a video on this, uh, because I think it's already been well established enough already that the Deepoka moderation team is just not good. Okay, it is terrible, and I think we all know this at this point. But the reason I'm making this video is because Dan VR um, recently just made two very good videos, which I recommend you guys go and watch. I will leave them in the description. He made two very good videos explaining just that, you know, like how the debug moderation team just like needs a change desperately, right? It needs a change and it is just, he's just describing all the problems that have been going on with it, right? So great videos, go watch them. But anyways, I'm here to basically give my side of the story, right? I saw those videos and I was like, all right, you know what? Screw it. I'm going to give my side of the story because it turns out that recently I've been banned from the server as well, just like he has. Now, I never really said anything about this um, because I, I didn't really want to deal with that. You know, I just I, I just didn't want to deal with that. Right. Like fight trying to fight against the, the moderation team without any like connections or anything. It's just it, it is just, you know, it, you, you're you're like trying to scale like mount everest without like any you know climbing gear or anything you're, you you get what i mean right like it's just you're not gonna get anywhere right you are not going to get anywhere so i just didn't bother with it but i and i don't expect to like get anywhere with this video as well but i, I i'm just here to give my side of the story right i'm just here to give my side of the story as well because it turns out that i've been banned for kind of a similar reason right just basically just shit posting and you know the the mod team just like took it way too seriously i mean to the point where it's just like straight up uncalled for so in my case i um basically got three warnings and how most of you should know already it's a three warning system and then you're gone and then you have to appeal so one of the warnings that i got was a year ago and i was basically posting something called Booboken, which was it, it, it was just it, just like all of these. Keep the keep this in mind. Just like all of these, they were they're all just like shit posts, right? That they are basically just taking way too seriously, right? So th this one was a, a little bit more on the deserved side, but it's still you know kind of uncalled for um, because they considered it NSFW, and you know how strict they are with NSFW stuff, and so I but but again it was just a joke, right? So. Booboken was just um, basically just like, you know, the, the in-game character models like Carlia and, you know, just like mo mostly female characters, right? And maybe some like con characters too. I, I don't even remember. remember. Um, but they, they, you know, it was basically just giving them like boobs and, you know, like ass and shit. So it was just like a shit post, right? Just your general shit post. It will, and this is the most important part. It wasn't even revealing. Okay, it wasn't even revealing. I would throw some pictures up, but I don't even think I have them anymore, right? Of the like original uh, pictures that I'm talking about, as well as like the chat logs, because I'm banned. So all of these, you know, for, for all of these, I'm basically gonna have like nothing to show because I, I'm banned. I can't go back and like look at them again. But anyways, that was the first warning and that was a year ago. So let me just say something else about that warn as well. So I was under the assumption, right, that anything that happened over a year ago, uh, over a year ago, right, anything that happened over a year ago or two won't be used against you in, you know, your, your warrants pretty much, right? Like I thought there would at least be some sort of expiration system after a year. At least that's what I thought, right? That's what seems the most fair to me. And that's actually something that I um, tried telling the uh, like it that, that's something I tried saying in the ticket when I was trying to appeal for the server the fact that you know a warning from a year ago like it really shouldn't be used against you if you were to like um, get banned like me right now so but but it turns out that it still was so it uh, oh well right but then we move on to the second one the second warning and this one is honestly just like the stupidest one okay this is uh, literally the, the most stupid one because all i did was just post a clip in general of agamatsu 
uh, just saying some like you know sus shit, right? Some like NSFW stuff, right? Um, it, 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 he was like reading it off of a donation or, or something. I, I don't know the context of it, okay? But that was three months ago, right? So obviously that one, I you know can't really say anything about that as far as like the the time that that it happened, right? Because it was three months ago. It's like fairly recent still. Um, but it, I, I feel like I really shouldn't have gotten a warning for that, you know, because I wasn't even the one saying it. Like, I, I literally just posted it in general, like, like I do with like many, like if you go in general and look at my chat logs, which I'm pretty sure is still there when you get banned from the server, I think your chat logs stay there, even if you're banned. And so it like every now and then I just, because I had, uh, like pick perms with the with the ganja creator role i pretty much just like went in and shit posted every once in a while you know just like throw in like a, a video or image here and there right just to like get a couple laughs and stuff right like no harm whatsoever right to anyone right and so you're really gonna warn me over a video of agamatsu saying something pretty much like i know that what he was saying was like nsfw stuff right but it wasn't showing anything, right? And it wasn't me saying it. So that's like completely unjustified, you know? It's like whatever mod decided to warn me for that, they, you know, they just weren't feeling it that day, right? They, they must have just like woken up on the wrong side of the bed, I guess. Because to me, that is just completely unjustified. And so now for the third and final warn that happened recently, it was also counted as an NSFW one, like the second one. And this one was more on me. Okay, I do admit to this, right? This was more on me just like being stupid, right? But I feel, I, I also feel like it, it was kind of like unjustified because again, it's just like a shit post, right? Like there's no harm being done here. And I'm, I'm not, it's not like I'm straight up, like especially considering, and this is um something that Dan Viewer touched upon. I mean, there were literally pedophiles, right? Like confirmed cases, right? No if fans or buts. It just confirmed pedophiles on the on the staff team, right? So can you just consider that for a moment, right? And then and then just compare it to me getting the third warn for quote basically just like saying some NSFW stuff about the about the characters once again as just like a shit post right i i don't even remember exactly what it was i think i said something about like a grip contest between like carlia elita and and uh it, i don't know claris or something i don't know that, that's it that's it right and so when you compare it to literally pedophiles on the staff team right that that shit is like nothing right it's literally like nothing right so was there harm? Was there any harm being done to anyone here? No. The only harm, actually, no. There was the only harm being done was was on Nactagonus. Which did I did I mention that? Yeah, Nactagonus, bro, was the one that gave me that third and final warning. Like, shouldn't you be making like OST for the game? You know, like, why are you worrying and getting butt hurt so much over literally like a harmless joke in general, bro? Like, like. Don't you have better things to be doing? Like, I, I can't put it any other way. Like, I, I, you know, it's just, like, it's just baffling how easy you can get banned from the server now by just, like, you know, like, saying some simple jokes, bro. Like, even, you know, like, I, I feel like you just can't say anything now without, like, insulting any of the mods, bro. This is why the moderation team needs, like, a severe change. And, like, especially with the fact that the minimum age to be a, a mod is 16 i mean that's just they, they need to raise that bro because it's like too many of the staff there are just like they get butthurt over everything and they're just power hungry as hell right they they abuse their authority and then they just you know get you banned right and that that's the end of it like to to them you are just like mod points that that's all they see you as they don't give a shit bro so it, it's like they don't even listen to you they like uh, like i said if you don't have connections or or literally get you know extremely lucky with like a, a nice mod then you are just not gonna get anywhere when it comes to like a restore or or you know a ban appeal or anything right like you're just gonna be screwed 
which is why it which is exactly why i'm making this video because like dan i also want to bring some more attention to this because it's just completely you know just unjust and the like at this point it just feels like 1984 literally 1984 like the, the actual embodiment of 1984 right but anyways that's my side of the story okay again go watch dan vr's videos if you want uh you know to get some more insight on this i i really recommend it um if you if you manage to sit to the end of this uh yapping session right then make sure to leave a like okay because i like for i, I don't expect to gain any subs from this video okay i like as long as you like, I'll be happy because then it'll actually, you know, push this video out to more people. I, I really do need people to, to like see this and just like bring more like eyes on it, just like Dan Beer is doing. So, so yeah, that's that's pretty much it. That that's it.